things are happening. Uh. That shield almost got shredded by that. Um. Hi, hello. Okay. Wait. IDK is back. One moment. Cool. Okay. Here we are. That is that is one thing you you gotta look out for. Um, I came out. I came back to an Alolan. What what's up? Yeah, no, that's a that's a big thing you gotta look out for is those side beats, <laughs> those revenges. You know, you gotta be careful. Wow! Wow! So, oh, Incineroar up there, man! It's like it's like Falco up here, except even better. Yeah, it's it's pretty good. Revenge is a very scary move. Oh yeah. And so is that. I mean, what character wouldn't want that move in their back pocket? You know what I mean? Yeah. It's insane. I I said I said like nice catch. at the last uh, last set that I saw Slim Jim play. I was like. I don't care how many sets he takes, I'm not falling for the Incineroar propaganda. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm falling for the Incineroar propaganda now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, because we were saying in their previous match that, like, look, like, Incineroar actually has some of the best moves in the game. It's just that they're on a character with a crap run speed and, like, bad stats. You know what I mean? Yeah. Any character would more than love, oh. like, Incineroar's moves. Yeah, hmm. yeah. Ding Dong Kid, that was almost entirely decided by edge guards. Um, yeah, yeah, and probably Incineroar hasn't got a good recovery. It's no, good. yeah, no, that's probably how you want to play that matchup, is just keep him away from the stage. Oh, you might know this answer, Akabird. Um, is, is drag down back air into, like, more back airs and, like, grabs with Mega Man? Is that a, is that a true thing? I swear I haven't seen it like that. Oh, we got, we got chat. It's not just propaganda, it's just facts. Yeah. You know, Incineroar is decent in Smash Ultimate. It's yeah, Mega Man back air is gonna be good for this matchup. <laughs> Chat talking about how busted Incineroar is, we love to see it. Uh, that, yeah. Yep. Nair at 50, baby. A little bit of a stage spike there, but that's fine. That's okay. That ju that's just, you know? God, I love, the, I love the Lariat moves so much. I don't know if revenge is based off of like the damage taken. Oh man, it, 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 you you really see how linear Incineroar's recovery is when Mega Man just has an option for every single option he chooses. Yeah. That being said, he's back. He's back. He is back. Nice ledge grab too. Oh, jump it, and angling the, angling the metal blade like that to snipe him down there. Yeah, totally. I have noticed that Ding Dong Kid likes to put the the up B like underneath the spawn platform to just make people jump <laughs> when they get down. <laughs> that was kind of cool. Did you see he wasn't even looking at him when he threw the middle blade behind? <laughs> yeah. I guess a big thing in this matchup for, for Meg. Ooh. Yes, it also stacks if you get multiple revenges. Oh, yeah. I see. Yeah, and Cinero is such a mean guy. Why does he need revenge multiple times? You know, that's not that's not justice, my guy. But then again, he'd probably say his placing on the tier list isn't justice. So you know, yeah. you've gotta just be mean about it. You do have to be careful with those projectiles, though, because you will just feed revenge. Not the hard up tilt, but we'll take it. Oh, unfortunate. Can I get some semi SDs in the chat? <laughs> I know we don't have them, but do it anyway. Semi SD. Here in sentimental power, force the SD. Force the d force the SD, man. True. Slingen True. really built different. Thanks, V. The the mental power 
than Incineroar exudes. Yeah, just a robot with no with no mental, you know, with no conscience of his own. I was mean, like, well, I have to walk off and just die now. Exactly. You know, like, like Incineroar gets intimidate, right? So that's what that was. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Incinna Roar. Crushing it. Ooh. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Mega Man waiting on the floor for a little bit. That's right. That's me. You're probably wondering how he ended up in this situation. Mm -hmm. Oh, every single one is able to challenge Incineroar there. When do we get Intimidate Incineroar in Smash where he gets a passive that nerfs the knockback? back? I think that's just called being heavier. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love the little trot into the f -tilt. That f -tilt is actually pretty strong. Yeah, that's being a heavyweight, I guess, yeah. Mm. Wait, my move isn't sending him as far. It must be as like as hockey or <laughs> so. <laughs> Make him happy. For some guys, they'd be a buff. Yeah, absolutely. Wow, he actually stopped mid back air and released the revenge. Nice. Yeah. Is that Lariat only like one hit? Like, like links upy. I think so, yeah, yeah, it is, it is. That, yeah, that seems like a really... One thing about Ding Dong Kid 2 is that he tends towards grabs as a punish, which is kind of just naturally just kind of going through the, the revenge oh, attempts yeah. of Incineroar. Oh, oh. The in oh, the invincibility on the up -y. That was a... Uh little bit of a reversal there, but that's that's fine. That's okay. That's okay for Ding Dong Yeah, kid. that middle blade, honestly, it's only really just tagging him and allowing him to side B again, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, sometimes, honestly, it'd be better to just hold off so that Incineroar has just less of Just wait for him to be yeah. normal. You're limiting his angles already. Oof. Pretty even. This is a huge start for the Sith. Uh oh. Oh, the stop didn't come out! That would totally would have killed! Yeah, you're punishing Slim by revenging your projectiles by hitting him with more <laughs> projectiles for free is really smart. Sheesh. Yeah, you're right. Oh, if he passed him during that move, that would have hit Mega Man instead. This is a really scary situation to be in. Just... Oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Ooh, what is going on? Oh, he's got revenge. This is so bad for Ding Dong. No! That's gonna be too much! Yep. Wow. With the revenge, especially, the Alolan mm. went untickable. Oof. Just informing folks, uh, Tekken. Tekken top 8 is going to start momentarily, uh, however, um, yeah, we initially planned our schedule around having a couple streams, and um, yeah, it's been a little difficult this weekend. So we're going to have top 4 for Tekken 7 um, on stream, guaranteed, for sure, so stay tuned for that after this. And no Kazuyas in this top 8, by the way. Damn. I mean, Mina could pull out, could pull out there, uh, Kalsia. True. But, ooh. <laughs> like the attempt. And Sonora F Smash surprisingly doesn't seem like a great move. No. It, it just seems like kind of a dopey kick that doesn't have a lot of range. 
Yeah, yeah. and uh, yeah, it looks like it has. It looks like it has a blind spot. Don't you just too, love though. it when like the reality validates your commentary? <laughs> exactly. Great. Yeah. And oh, nice space by Dungong Kid, but even better snag by Slim Jim. I think a big thing for Ding Dong Kid is like, especially after losing that last that last game, does not want to go off to contest in Sinor in case you get side beat there. <laughs> the pallet! Hitting him with the down air though. Blue Lagoon, um, I'm only trying to ban one character at a time, thank you. <laughs> Are you banning Kazuya? <laughs> no, no, I would never ban Kazuya. Oh, it is multi hit, I was wrong. Oh. I think I guess there are weak hits from the flurry of hits that uh, the middle B is. What is going on? Oh my goodness! There's too much going on. I love the tech chase with the middle blade. Kind of like it. Kind of mm. smooth. Oh, where was the forward smash or something? You know. <laughs> Bit of a trade superior for Slim Jim. Oh. Nice. Ding dong. Uh, He's dead. <laughs> no one, everyone with a delayed reaction because nobody thought that it was going to kill. I didn't even see like the, the like sparks that would indicate a kill. But. Yeah, yeah. And Sin McLeod. Too soon. Tap Dumper just got knocked out by Slim Jim. And you're saying that in chat? <laughs> you come into my chat? <laughs> Talking about Tap Jumper, how dare you stand where he stood? Oh, oh no, the oh, Delta no. doesn't get the, get the snipe. I was hoping it would. Oh, yeah, this is a bad position for Incineroar. Uh, this is a good mind. position for it's, Incineroar. It's a good, this is a good in position for Incineroar now. <laughs> Come on, where is it? Don't shield on the platform, Ding Dong. You know what's going to happen. Don't do it. Don't fall for it. Good job. Don't fall for the propaganda. He's bad. Oh, no. That's more. <laughs> Listen. Exactly. Do totally not would get... Have done it. Oh, okay. Yep. You want to get rid of that revenge there. Oh, that that, that was it, I think. Yeah. There we oh, go. Game out. five, baby. Take it. Her game five. Ding dong kid. So composed. So composed. Is there anything that can break this man? Well, I don't know. Game five with a grappler in top eight has got to be something. It sure is. <laughs> It, it it has go it's it's got to be like mentally demanding to like constantly just have to avoid that one grab especially like i mean i guess you can focus on it more when incineroar is glowing off of revenge but true but do you ever want to be in that situation that's the real question no let's go slin love from cleveland thanks high speed I'm sure, I'm sure Slim Jim would be happy to hear that. Let's see if it can get them to clutch out this game five. <laughs> Wrong account. <laughs> What's up, Jax? <laughs> oh. Oh. oh my god, I thought that was just going to be a stock trade, but Slim Jim actually comes out on top there. Yeah. Or, oh, it doesn't have revenge anymore. Got grab. Never mind. <laughs> you get revenge and you down throw. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> god damn it. Slim Jim going for it all in game five. Oh, wow! <laughs> Let's go, Ding Dong. That was awesome. That was. That was so good. Such a good use of the Crash Bomber there. Let's see if he can seal the stock after such a play though. Leaf Shield seems like a pretty good tool in this matchup actually. Just a nice... Don't be near me right now. <laughs> <laughs> you, get, you can't grab me. Go away. I am going to get into your bubble and you cannot grab me. 
Oh, that could be crucial. Honestly, that back air missing might have just decided to sit. We'll see though. Slinger missed a crucial back air, uh, back throw just now. Being off stage against Incineroar. Oh my goodness. Crash Bomber, oh. Nair! My god. Down tilt up air. Down tilt up air is gonna take that. Oh, down tilt. Honestly, one of the most consistent and like really great normals in the game. It's like insane. Oh my. Oh. This is so bad. Oh, okay. okay, okay, okay. Oh, his revenge didn't last long enough for the Crash Bomber. Popped it like, just a second later, even mm. less. And as you were saying, Echo, but the leaf shield was really helping there because they were both in a really awkward situation on stage. Mm. Oh, that caught! Oh yeah, nice use of the lariat after the tap jump to sit. It wasn't really working for them. Oh, this is so crucial for Dingdong Kid to hit. Catching the up, uh, up B. Sorry. Meaty's the ledge get up. Sinora doesn't get revenge off the Crash Bomber. Ooh, that was such a if to. There! Both players are looking quite nervous here. Nair? Oh, that Nair is going to oh. take it though. Oh, very well played. Very well played. Oh, man. A game five. Great game five from both players. And Ding Dong Kid never broken. I was, I was fully like 180. It's going to be fine. <laughs> uh, congrats to Slim Jim. It's going to go ahead to lose his semis.